country. And this week's superfan has stared death right in the face, so it's no wonder this Reaper is not scared of a one and one record. Jesse Escabel, aka the Bronco Reaper, walks more than 15,000 steps every home game. That's exactly what a super van does, is not just dress up and, and, and take pictures, but wilds up that, that crowd and gets them ready. Halloween first inspired the Reaper costume, but when Jesse's health started declining, he fought death so much, he became it. After I kind of realized that um, I wasn't scary and that I could actually um, get people not to be so scared of death, I thought that, uh, and uh, I went out and started just telling my story. About 19 years ago, Jesse started having debilitating seizures and several heart attacks after he contracted West Nile encephalitis. And I had surgery, brain surgery, to just uh, remove my temple uh, uh, in 2007. The surgery didn't help, and he ended up on life support about five years later. I found that we die here mentally and, and then later physically. So if we can keep a positive my attitude and a mentality, we have a better chance on actually surviving. And that's what got him through, along with his love for the Broncos. In 2022, Jesse was the only NFL fan from Colorado nominated for the Ford Hall of Fans at the Pro Football Hall of Fame. Your amazing Denver Broncos super fandom. One of his favorite Broncos, Steve Atwater, made the surprise announcement. It really is amazing. Uh, I've heard some amazing stories by uh, quite a few of our super fans, and uh, the Reaper, his, his situation is, is super special. He didn't win, but his dedication to his favorite team and the fans has never wavered. Usually, again, you're afraid of death, but for just a split second, you're not for with me. You actually get that that freedom of not being afraid of death and just embracing the Broncos. When he uh, when he sees fans from the other team, he always tells them he's there to take their soul. <laughs> he does say that. I like I love seeing these stories. I just like the backstory. That's what's I so know. great about these. I know. And he's overcome so much. Yeah. So and he said everything's been good. So I, mean it forward. I, like I know. It, you know. It's great. Well, you can get in on the orange zone, share your super fan story with us so I can feature you ahead of Broncos home games. Email us at orangezone at cbs.com or post on our Facebook page, or you can just nominate someone too. That'd be great.